Have you ever wished you could turn your imaginative words into vivid, moving images? What if there was a way to not just create still images from text, but to generate entire animations? Well, the future is here, and it's even better than you imagined. So let me introduce you Animate Diff, which is an innovative framework that takes personalized text to image models to the next level by generating animations. They've got this cool feature where they present an image on a page. And guess what? When you click on the image, it magically transforms into a quick three second animation. It's so awesome to see these various images come to life right before your eyes. There's this one where the character's hair is blowing in the wind and it looks stunning. Then there's another with a cyberpunk character that looks really cool and futuristic. And oh, how can I forget the adorable little chipmunk or squirrel happily munching away? They even have this animated dude and you can see him moving his head. It's like they've breathed life into these images making them so dynamic and engaging. In simple terms, this paper discusses Animate Diff, a framework that extends personalized text to image models to generate animations without the need for specific tuning. The framework learns motion patterns from large video datasets and can be incorporated into personalized text to image models. These models could be either trained by the user or downloaded from platforms like Civit AI or Hugging Face. Once the motion modeling module is trained, it can be inserted into any personalized text-to-image model. This allows these models to generate diverse and personalized animated images based on text inputs. The scientists evaluated the framework using various public text-to-image models across anime pictures and realistic photographs, indicating that their proposed framework enhances these models' performance. The first step in training any machine learning model is to collect and prepare the data. In this case, the authors use large video data sets to train their model. Videos are essentially sequences of images, frames. So this data set would provide the model with lots of examples of how objects can move from one frame to the next. The authors mention a motion modeling module. This is likely a machine learning model that is trained to recognize and predict motion between frames in a video. This module is trained using the video data set collected in the first step. Once the motion modeling module is trained, it can be inserted into existing text-to-image models. Text-to-image models are AI models that take a text description as input and generate a corresponding image. By incorporating the motion modeling module, these models can now generate sequences of images, animations, that depict the described motion. After the model has been trained and the motion module has been integrated, the system can generate animations from text descriptions. The text description would need to include information about both the objects in the animation and the motions they should perform. The last step is to evaluate the animations generated by the model and adjust the model's parameters as needed to improve its performance. This might involve comparing the model's animations to human-created animations or using other methods to assess the quality of the animations. As text-to-image models like stable diffusion and personalization techniques such as LoRa and DreamBooth become more advanced, they have made it easier and cost-effective for anyone to turn their imagination into high-quality images. This has led to an increased interest in methods that can animate these images, integrating motion dynamics with the generated static visuals. At the heart of this proposed framework is the addition of a fresh motion modeling module to the fixed base text to image model. This module is then trained on video clips to learn and internalize suitable motion patterns. Once this training phase is completed, this motion modeling module can be incorporated into any personalized model derived from the base one. The result is a text-driven model that can generate a variety of personalized animated images.